a solar ironing car designed by a class 9 girl from Tamil Nadu has won the, her the Children's Climate Prize from Sweden. The innovation has the potential to improve air quality as it could completely eliminate the use of charcoal in conventional irons. With 10 million ironing carts estimated across the country releasing a lot of smoke, burning 50 million kilos of charcoal every day, this could be a game changer. NDTV's Sam Daniel caught up with the 14-year-old. Congratulations. How does it feel? It feels amazing to win the Children's Climate Prize. I'm also really happy that environmental innovations like the solar ironing cart are gaining international importance. How does it work? You have the solar panel on top of the cart and they wouldn't require charcoal at all? No. The main aim of the ironing cart itself is to eliminate the usage of charcoal and thus prevent deforestation. So if you purchase the solar ironing cart, then you won't need to buy charcoal at all because according to the ironing vendors themselves, it costs around 700 to 1000 rupees a day to buy charcoal. So even though initially the cart which costs 30,000 to 40,000 Indian rupees may seem like a lot of money, it's a worthy investment because you won't need to by charcoal for around seven to eight years. For how long will they be able to use the iron box? The iron box can be used continuously on battery power for six hours. How big is this problem in India and how much would this change if our community of people who iron using charcoal switch to this system? Well the first thing is there may be around 10 million ironing cuts in India alone and each of them burn around 5 kg of charcoal. So totally, in a day, they burn around 50 million kg of charcoal every day in India alone. But the fact is that charcoal-based irons aren't only used in India, but in many developing countries across the world. So if all ironing vendors switch to solar ironing cuts, it would drastically improve the air quality in India, thus helping climate change, uh, preventing climate change across the world. What would this mean for our environment? It means a lot to the environment. There's a common misconception that uh, if someone innovates something or there's an environmental change act going on in a specific part of the world, it only helps people in their locality. Mm -hmm. But actually, it benefits the whole globe as a whole because air and atmosphere are the same across the earth. So Thank you so much for your time and you're certainly a great inspiration. Thank you very much again for the parents for your time. Let's raise at Thiruvannamalai, Sam Daniel, Findy TV.